two deaths following a tragic fire. Tributes from leading figures in horse racing. Kieran Fallon spoke today of the racing world sadness at the death of two young jockeys in a suspected arson attack. The youngsters, 18-year-old Jamie Kine and 19-year-old Jan Wilson, perished in the blaze yesterday in Norton near Moulton, North Yorkshire. They were having a party at the time. A local man in his 30s was being questioned by detectives, released today on conditional police bail. Families of the pair are still waiting for police to confirm the identities of the two victims, but the teenagers have been missing since the blaze swept through their block in the early hours. Mr Kine was due to ride at Haydock yesterday. His parents, Jerry and Madeline, his four brothers and younger sister, are today being comforted by relatives at their stud farm in Ireland. And race meetings across the country have been holding silences and flying flags at half-mast as a mark of respect. Another jockey, Ian Brennan, was also at the flat, jumping to safety from a window. Trainer Tony Quinn said Brennan suffered only minor injuries. Well, it's very difficult to come to terms with it because, I mean, you either stop or you keep going, but obviously you've got to try and keep going. It's, it's, it's awful, really. The bodies of the victims remained in the burnt-out building overnight as emergency services were to make the structure safe enough for them to enter. The only signs of the blaze visible from the pavement were two charred window frames on the first floor of the red brick property overlooking a churchyard. Families of both the victims have paid their respects today to the jockeys who were rising stars. The chief executive of the Professional Jockeys Association said in a statement that the racing world was united in grief.